Hey everybody, the Bong is here, ready to give you a brand new Let's Play. Magical Poppin for the Super Nintendo. Now this was a game that was suggested to me in the 2020 Christmas special, and from the looks of it, I don't know if this was suggested to me because the game is good, or because the main character is a girl. I'm starting to believe that just because the main character is a girl that somebody wanted me to play this. But you know what? I've only played, like, barely the first stage, like, maybe halfway through it, so let's not write it off yet. It does seem very whimsical in its own right, and I did have to find a translation patch for it because it was not released in North America. You know what? Why don't we give it a fair shake? It shouldn't be a long one, it's just one of those SNES platformers. That kind of thing. Like, oh no, something is floating and we can't, we're so scared! Hello, I am Blonde Girl with Magic! I shoot light beams! Oh no, I also cannot fly because I have legs and gravity. <laughs> Alright, the town looks like it's something out of Dracula X. <laughs> Oh my god, the music. Alright, so you move around with, you know, the B button, of course. You use the Y button to attack. If you're holding, like, diagonally and hit jump, you slide. And apparently you have magic attacks as well. And you also have a pogo stick attack, where if you hold down and hit Y while in midair, you can attack from above. So, you know, that's pretty cool. You do have magic, by the way, but you gotta use the A button to use it. And the number under your spell determines how much it costs. So, for instance, this spell that I have costs two stars. Stars are, of course, your uh, magic energy, by the way. Oh, I guess I'm supposed to go down. I can use the shoulder buttons to switch spells, but I only have one spell currently. My hearts, of course, are my health. And I, that's how many lives I have. Pretty s simple. I mean, at least the control scheme is really good. She has to make a noise like, Hey, 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 hey. Every time she attacks. Like, it might eventually drone on like halfway through the game. But you'll get used to it after a while. Hope it's not too quiet or anything. Oh god, slimes. It had to be the slimes. Well, at least it does no fall damage. <laughs> oh. Guess I have to use the trampoline to get up on this platform. Alright, so let's keep going. Yeah, we're still stuck in the sewer. Oh, and the cake gives you health, too. Which right now I don't have to worry about because my health is pretty high and also fire lizards. Hey. Oh. Guess you don't want to fight, huh? Let me see what's up here. Oh, wow. Totally impaled that bat. Oh, we can go in here. I mean, sometimes you'll find alternate routes to find stuff. So... Definitely do your due diligence and explore. Because you might find treasure chests like this. Yay, I found someone's beating heart. Better not bring that to a doctor or something. You know, in case they need an organ transplant. But yeah, you can even find hearts that will give you more health. Oh, I found a bust. I believe if you find a few of these, you'll get an extra life. So try to find as many as you can if you feel like you're pretty short on it. Oh, hello. Oh god, he's throwing furniture! Okay, I guess I gotta wait for the uh, furniture to drop. And then I can attack this sorcerer. Or just do that. That works too. Oh, 
Pretty overdramatic explosion right there. Hope they paid off that house. <laughs> They're not gonna get that damage deposit back. Okay, these walls are very annoying. Like, you might have to wait for them to drop, and then you can shoot them with a spell. Or maybe I actually had to hit them from above when they attack like this. Okay, I'm just gonna go in the house. Not like they can chase you in here. I want so mad. Why are you so mad about it? I gotta go in the basement. Because there's these blocks that I can't do anything with until I get a new spell. So yeah, you have to look for spells in this game. So you can actually use them, of course. Oh. <laughs> There's just a random magic shrine in someone's house. There, so now we have the magnifying glass. This one, of course, costs four magic to use. Also, I forgot to mention, apparently there's an advanced version of a spell, but in order to use it, you have to hit SELECT. Yeah, SELECT is not really a button you would associate to attacks of any kind, but in this game, that's how you use your, your most damaging spells. Of course, they cost more MP to use. So, be wise about it, of course. It looks like this- oh, well, that was a cheap shot. Looks like the spell I have is just a bomb. Wait, what if I go up here? Okay, that's just for a bunch of stars. I mean, I'm down with that. Wait, how do I get up here? Oh, I think I was supposed to do that from before. Like, before I dropped down the hole, I could have gotten there. Oh, well. Guess I'll just have to make do without it. Oh, sweet candy! That also heals you. Oh, hello. Oh, another one of these idols. Oh, one more and I get an extra life. Get out of here, you bastard. Is there any real reason? Ah, damn! Stab me right, right through the box. How dare you use clipping? Okay, was that a good idea to go this way now? I don't know. <laughs> Might have missed a chest or something to heal me. I mean, at least I can get help from enemies. Also, a secret passage. Okay, fine, be that way. Alright, so, we're still in the sewers, apparently. I should be close to the end of the stage, I hope. Oh god, they even got a tank! Which you can attack from underneath, hitting the treads. Uh-oh. Okay, I think I'm low on health. Two hits, I'm done. Oh, look, it's a gargoyle. Oh, wow! <laughs> okay, I see what I gotta do. Okay, that I wasn't expecting! Okay, I gotta watch its movement pattern. And I'm dead. Wasn't much I could've done about that. I was on low health. Oh, okay, so you don't just start right next to the boss. Now, I don't know about the continue system in this game. Like, do I have continues? I trust that's a thing, right? Maybe I gotta hit him with magic. Okay, I'm watching you. Okay, you can't hit him when he does that attack. Ooh. But you can hit him like when he gets out of that 
base. Alright, so a couple more hits, he's done. Luckily, if you hit him, you can knock him back. So I just gotta watch its movement, and then I'm good. One more. Got him. Alright, once you understand, like, uh, what attack pattern it has, you're good. Look at those penguins run away. Yeah! Okay, so that's the first stage. Took a little bit of a beating at the end, but we're gonna be fine. Alright, we're on to stage two in the woods. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'll stop here, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. See you there, everyone.